Hello and welcome to this video on the Magello Audio MLEG Envelope Generator and LFO Eurorack module. Now up front I'd like to thank Magella Audio for sponsoring this video. Now the MLEG is a 6 HP ADSR with looping functionality, a polarizer which is an attenuverter and slow and fast modes. We can loop making this a looping attack and decay as you can see on the LED there. And when we're in loop mode, if we plug a cable into gate, we can have a gate dependent loop where it will only gate and let through these signals while a gate signal is present. Now a really simple module, lots of little patches exploring how tight and snappy this is and long and evolving it can be. So time and index on screen, skip around as you see fit and let's dive in. So here's a fun patch that started with me looking for these longer evolving bass tones. A couple of oscillators at first come into the Magella filter for some high pass filtering with some accent modulation and I'm using the envelope to affect resonance as well. So carving into the low end with this filter first, modulating its resonance with the envelope before coming into the fusion filter to the left there which has its cutoff modulated by the screen trace, the longer ADSR envelope that we can see in here. Now I could make this short and snappy. But having that slow mode on, some attack. Nice thick, dirty bass sound. So here's two wavetable oscillators hard left and right into a big stereo reverb. Now this is set to slow, I'm going to set it to loop and we'll just hear it really slowly shifting through these wavetables. So you've got that nice log rise and then that seemingly faster exponential decay. Now setting these much closer to full. You can see in here we get nice long looping envelopes. So here's a patch where I'm using the same envelope to control both the filter and the VCA for a combination low pass gate style sound. Now my sound will get brighter as it gets louder as the filter cut off on the low pass will rise. As the level of the envelope opening the VCA rises too. But the purpose of this short little example here is just to show how snappy this envelope can be. Now you'll notice we can get this kind of nice and clicky and short. If you want to roll back those clicks and actually soften the attack, tiniest bit of attack time there is all you need to do that. I quite like them in, it's nice and percussive. So here's a low pitched self oscillating filter and this is running in loop mode at audio rates and increasing the level we're going to audio rate FM, 
this filter. And you can hear we go well into audio rate. And these looping modulations are great when we get them into nice expressive and tight responsive VCAs to create percussion sounds. So here I'm using the envelope for the pitch FM on an oscillator to create this percussion sound. There's a couple of ways that I would approach making percussion. If I just wanted a decay for that initial thump and impact, I'd be looking to tune in an amount of that falling pitch envelope. And that would give me a nice soft basic kind of thump. Another way to approach this is to actually tune up with a sustain. Add this release and then add an additional spike with that decay. I find I can often be that bit more dynamic if I can vary the gate length coming into an envelope and using an ADSR to control the pitch when I'm synthesizing percussion. So here I'm making use of the gated looping feature where this will only loop when there's a gate present. And we can see we're getting interrupted, gated, fast loops from the envelope there. I'm mixing this gated looped envelope in with the existing envelope and LFO. So if you watch the yellow trace and listen to the effect on the filters cut off. Again, these little kind of ratchet bursts are accenting these little spikes into the filter. So that's it for this video on the MLEG Envelope Generator and LFO from Magella Audio. Check out links in the description, support my work on patreon.com forward slash divkid and join the growing community over there. Leave a comment, hit the thumbs up and I'll see you next time. Cheers. <laughs>